Hello everyone, good morning. Today is April 27th, 2024. This is daily educational guide for your minds. Our topic today is on healthy relationship. We we'll take our Bible text from 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verse 33, and Proverbs chapter 22, verses 24-25. Amen. Our memory verse is taken from the book of Proverbs chapter 13, verse 20, which says, He that walks with the wise shall be wise, but a companion of fools shall be destroyed. Let us pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, O Lord, we pray that you make us wise in you always, in the name of Jesus. Grant us wisdom in the name of Jesus. O Lord, Father, with every companion of evil people or foolish people you've been working with, we pray that you Lord disconnect us from them in the name of Jesus. Help us, Lord, for in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. When God wants to bless you, he sends certain people to you. And when the devil also wants to attack you, when he wants to destroy you, he also does the same thing. God uses relationships in our life in important ways. But some relationships are not healthy for you. Unhealthy relationships can happen between families, friends, co-workers, members, church partners, romantic partners, romantic relationships rather. It contaminates your way and um, the way of your self-esteem. Amen. It contaminates your happiness and the way you see yourself and the world. It makes you feel drained, depleted, and sometimes even distraught. God's word tells us in James chapter 3, verse 16, that for where every and strife is, there is confusion and every evil work and unhealthy relationship brings neg negativity and pain to you here are what the bible says about unhealthy relationship in proverbs chapter 13 verse 20 it says a companion of fool shall be destroyed in proverbs chapter 22 verses 24 to 25 says make no friendship with an angry man and with a furious man, thou shalt not go, lest thou learn his ways, and get a snare to thy soul. What is this Bible verse telling us? It is telling us that you shall not move with furious men, with angry men, because if you move with them, you always learn their ways, and it is dangerous to you. It is dangerous to your soul as well. First Corinthians chapter 13, verse 33 says, Do not be deceived. Evil, corruption, evil communications corrupt good manners. Do not be deceived. Evil communications corrupt good manners. Stay away from evil communications. Stay away from people that can corrupt your good manners. Scriptural truth. Show me your friend and I will tell you whom you are. Show me your friend and I will tell you whom you are. Prayer point. Pray. Lord, deliver me from every unhealthy relationship. In Jesus' name. Father, deliver me from every unhealthy relationship in the name of Jesus. O Lord, Father, we pray that you Lord deliver us from every unhealthy relationship in the name of Jesus. O Lord, set people. Grant us the grace of men that will be for us, that will be to stretch us to be for our elevation in the name of Jesus. Waking us to move with companion of wise people. I am your excellent and so Jesus, my name, we will pray. Come for Christ, I will live.